Hello and what is going on today guys, Tomcat here and in this video we are back in pure rock crawling and we're going to be continuing our, I guess, quest through the, um, through the career mode. I don't know if I'd call it a quest, but it's more or less continuing on with the career mode. Now we do have a new vehicle and that is this Suzuki Samurai style vehicle and this thing is actually like it's really cool We've had the you know the normal version of this vehicle for a while But this is the exo caged version and there's a lot of new stuff to do with it So we're gonna go ahead and go into let's see we need level 8 for this next map So what I think I'm gonna do is try to improve my rating on this stage and that should, hopefully, if we do all these all these stages perfectly, that should really help us in terms of getting ranked up. Now, this is a very light and nimble vehicle, but it's not perfect. And when I say it's not perfect, I, whoa, that was close. When I say it's not perfect, I mean it's a little tippy. So, with it being a little tippy, you have to kind of factor that in um, whenever you're going through any kind of course with it. Because... If you even knock these cones by even the slightest amount, your run is, like, ruined if you're trying to get a perfect run. So let's get a little bit further up through the... That, that gate's wide. Really wide. And it helps that this thing is so narrow. It really, really helps. And I'm honestly really grateful for that fact. But let's just ease it on down through this gate. No big deal at all kind of working it up through these rocks real quick. God, no big deal whatsoever. Just soars right through. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's gate five. Trying to set myself up. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad. There it is. A little bit further, a little bit further. Oh, God. Oh, that was too far to the left. I love how narrow this thing is, though, compared to the, the, the Toyota. Oh, my God. The Toyota feels like a boat compared to this little thing. Don't hit that outside cone. What's funny is it looks like, like, for example, on that one back there, it looked like I was more, uh, like, it looked like I was closer to hitting the outside cone, when in all reality, that was just an illusion, and I was really closer to hitting the inside cone than the outside one. So there's a lot of, like, perspective things that come into play here for sure. Sticking with this line. Go straight ahead. There we go. Not bad. Just one more to cross. Be careful with this one. And drop in. Not bad. And that is the line. Feel pretty good about that one. That was overall 100. All right. Next stage. Let's go. This one should be fairly simple. These should all be fairly simple, especially for this thing. I mean, the capabilities of this thing, pretty freaking high. Not only are the capabilities high, but, like, dude, all I can think about right now is unlocking that buggy. That buggy is freaking intense, dude. Like, there's so much that you should be able to do with that. I mean, all that we've driven in this game up to this point has been, like, you know, fairly normal, streetable trail rigs. But that buggy is on a totally different level and should be a totally new experience. This one's gonna be... This one's gonna be a little tricky. Come on. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that either. Oh, this one's gonna... Th this one's gonna suck. Especially to try to get right. Come on, back up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on! God, it doesn't want to go anywhere. There we go. There we go. That kind of unstuck it. We'll go to the right and then maybe cut back. Let uh, That doesn't seem like it's going to work either. All it wants to do is fall over to the right. This one's difficult. This one's very hard. There we... Nope. Screw it. Go through it. Yep. The second you touch a cone... You just, you better just go. Ooh, I restarted, and I've only hit one cone so far, but I'm really close to hitting that one right there. And I really hope I don't, because I really want to preserve this run. 
God, why is there have to be a freaking boulder right there? Yep, nope. For God's sake, this map is so annoying. Holy crap, this map is annoying. So I think I should have still only hit two cones, which is not bad. It's just not quite as good as I wanted to do. Yeah, two. So, eh. It's kind of just one of those things where you're just like, eh, I, I'm not, not a fan. Let's try and get through this one perfectly. This thing has just such a low overhang in the front that it hits everything. Come on, 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 come on. Trying not to go over. Trying not to go over. Let's go, let's go. Whoa, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Come on. God, I've got like my, my, I'm like all focused right now because I just want to get, I, I just want to get through this map without hitting any cones. And it's like I'm trying to just focus on it. Oh, for God's sake, I hate the ones where it freaking leans your truck over. And it's like, oh, by the way, you're going to take that cone out with your freaking roof. That one, I thought we were going to hit the cone on the right. Where's our next? Is it six down there? I guess so. Woo, boy. That was almost a rollover. That was almost a big rollover. There we go. Come on. Oh, jeez. That's so close. Oh, my God. That's so close. That one's going to suck. Yeah, that's going to take out a bunch of cones if I go that way. That'll probably take out both. The problem with this thing is that it is so top-heavy, it's stupid. Like, it's so stupid top-heavy. God, you have to think about your lines so much. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Well, that's... That kind of sucks. Hmm. How do you propose we come back from that? Oh, we can drive out of it, apparently. Oh, but we can probably, but we can high center ourselves out of it. Oh my god. So we finally ranked up to level 8, and now we can, uh, now we can tr try out this new map. And I'll tell you something, like, getting up to level 8 was a little frustrating. <laughs> uh, some of the courses we ran, woo, like, we're so close to perfect, and then, my god... Like, we're so close to getting some of them perfect, and then it was like, it just nicked a cone by the tiniest amount. And it was like, oh, sorry, but, uh, nah, fam. And I was like, really? So, oh, it's just one of those things. Let's go. There we go. Yo, that was nerve-wracking. This game could be so nerve-wracking if you're trying to go for perfect runs. Free roam is just super chill, but, like, if you're trying to go for perfect runs, my god, is it nerve-wracking. Seriously. All right, up and over, up and over, up and over. Oh, oh my god, up and over, please. Wow. You, No, you cannot tell me that this thing will not be able to do that. I was about to say, that, that would just be bad. That would just be horrible. I would expect this thing to be able to climb up that. I really do want to get up to level 9 because we get a freaking buggy when we get to level 9. And it looks like we get some sort of crazy, like, off-road park map, too, when we hit level 10. So we've got rank-up goals for sure. Or at least definitely reasons to, you know, reasons to push for ranking up. That's gate 7 already. This one's been going fast. I love the texturing on this one, too. It's got a really cool atmosphere to it. Almost other planet-like. It's kind of weird, but it's cool. There we go. Uh-oh. Where's gate 10? So like way, way out there somewhere. Oh crap, I hate this one. Oh, no, we're good. <laughs> wow. All right, it looks like there's cones. There's gate number 10. Wow, they hide that one off in the distance, like way the hell out there. Do I want to hit it from this? Eh. I can try. Oh, we're good. Yeah, we're good. Come on. Uh, not bad. 
Oh god, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh, let's go. Come on. Uh, it's iffy. Yeah, it's if. <gasps> oh, don't you dare. Guarantee you we can fix this. <laughs> yes. I love how you can do that. It's so hilarious to me. But that should be, if I'm not mistaken, that should be a perfect run. If it is, like, that would be awesome. Our first run through there, perfect. Yes, zero cones. Next stage, let's go. This one looks not too bad. Oh, for reset after that. If you hit the first gate, you may as well restart. Like, if you hit a cone on the first gate, it's one of those things where it's like, screw it, restart. You have to. You pretty much have to. Come on. Oh, God. <laughs> That's close. That's really freaking close. Come on. Just a little bit for... Uh, I don't like that angle. I really don't like the angle we were coming up at. Oh, for God's sake. Well, I'll take one. I'll take one cone. Just no more. If we hit another one, we're restarting. That sound just, like, gets to me, too. Because it's like, nope, you screwed up. And it's like, oh, it just... Man, it, it's... it's it, For some reason, this game is so good at, you know, making you, making you feel like, God, I screwed up. You know what I mean? Like, if you mess up any of these gates, it really, it really nags at you, dude. Not skipping the gate. I'm just aligning myself with it. Oh, back up. Come on. It's like, back up properly. Don't do that. Ooh, there we go. Oh, not bad at all. Pop it up this rock. There she goes. There she goes. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's go. There it is. You know, honestly, I'm pretty okay with this whole thing now. It's weird. This map gets, like, really hard, and then it's like, it just levels out. That one, I went through at full throttle. I didn't even care. It still didn't hit anything, so I'm good with it. Work your way up these rocks nice and carefully. This one looks like it might be one where you could tip really... Oh, my God! I was going to say you could tip real easy on that one, and it definitely... So, that's two cones hit, which really sucks, but... Yeah. It's a two-star. Why? Why? Oh, that was weird. That cone almost, like, fell over. Just a little bit further now. A little bit further. Come on, around this left-hander. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, my God. That was, that was avoidable. That was 100% avoidable. We can, we can do that over. That was so avoidable. Like, so easily avoidable, too. Come on. There she goes. Not bad. Okay. Easily avoidable. That's one, and then coming around for another one. Come on, come on, come on. There she goes. Not bad. All right, gate five. I'm going to want I want to, I think, go up. Nope. Oh, please. Not here. Not now. Oh, not here. Not now. Don't do the thing, please. Oh, don't do the thing. <laughs> we'll just walk it back. And then stand it up. There you go. You get you get better at that as you go along, by the way. It's definitely something that you get better at. Oh, for God's sake, why does it just... Like, if you get it in a place that it doesn't like, it just stops. Like, it 100% just stops. Put up the... Oh, for God's sake. Not worrying about that one. I'm just going. Oh, this one's just... That is just mean. Oh, my God. All right. Screw that gate. Screw that gate and screw that cone. Oh, man. This one has been... This one has been challenging. And this one has been... Actually, it's funny. This... Like, you feel it. You feel the frustration, like, building up inside you when you hit those cones. You're like, oh, it's just... Oh, my God. And you really have to just be like, okay, I'm going to chill now. I'm going to chill now. I'm going to chill now. Oh, 
man. Oh, boy. All right. That one was, uh... God, that one really does, like, get after you. But, man, so New World uh, was pretty cool. Um, I, I think it was definitely fun. So we got to try out the caged uh, little samurai thing. We got to try out a new world. And then in the next episode, we should have something really freaking crazy for you guys. So if you are, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Tell me in the comment section down below what you guys thought of it. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time. Talk to you all later.